Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show how to install Lombok jar in HTS. Okay, so firstly, if you're watching this video, make sure you have installed HTS uh, in your laptop. If you have not installed it, firstly, please install it. And uh, for that, I have also given video link in the description of this video. You can follow that video to install HTS properly in your laptop. And if you have installed it, now we can continue. So firstly, open the browser. Okay. I'm using Google Chrome. Definitely you can use your favorite browser and uh, I'll search here. Lombok jar download. Then you'll be able to see this link project Lombok.org. Firstly, click on this download link and here you have to click on download link and uh, yeah it has started to download and we can see here lombok.jar let it download and we can see here it got downloaded now let's open our downloads folder so for installing it you can simply double click on it So here by default it will automatically detect the HDS location but if you are not able to see this I'll, let me cancel this and what you can do is you can specify the location where you have installed the HDS so here I have installed in the program files in the C drive okay so here it is HDS4 and you have to click on spring tool suit 4 this is the this icon you can see here and the same thing you can do for the Eclipse ID also simply select the go to the location of the installation part of the Eclipse ID and select the this icon okay this application select and check mark this select this then install and you will be able to see install successful and quit installer once that is done then simply restart the HTS or Eclipse ID okay so I'll click on file and here restart So now here I'll click on help and I'll click on about Spring HTS4 and here you will be able to see Lombok. So now we can say uh, Lombok is successfully installed in our HTS or Eclipse ID. Okay. So in this way we can install Lombok jar in our HTS or Eclipse ID. So I hope you guys liked the video and it has helped you to install Lombok in HTS or Eclipse ID. If you like the video and if it has helped you, please do like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. We will meet soon in my next video. Till then take care and bye bye.